Hi there subscribers, viewers, internet friends, Chicky Scrubs and fellow Kekistanis. Big Man Tyrone here to wish happy birthday to all our December born viewers. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of you out there are called Noel and Noella. <laughs> the first Noel. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now, one thing I love Christmas, guys, is because, you know, it's a time of singing, a time of so many beautiful songs from every corner of the earth. The first Noel, the angel did say. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'd serenade you guys there, born in the month of December. Now guys, December is the last month of the year. And that means also guys that it's the year of stock, it's, it's a month guys, it's a month of stock taking. Alright, you know guys, I'm all about goals and you know, planning one's future, you know, setting goals, priorities. <laughs> <laughs> setting goals prioritizing them achieving them guys okay and today I like to say something about failure guys I want to say something about failure a lot of the time failure is blamed um, as a sign of mediocrity is blamed as a sign of you know not being serious when someone fails at something they are blamed you know they are scapegoated for those of us who are in church, guys, when you fail, it's often ascribed to a curse, all right, or an ancestral curse, usually. Something that happened to your forefathers, that's now happening to you, okay? But guys, I want to take the myth out of failure. Because failure, guys, as someone once said, someone once said, he said failure is not only the output of, you know, of, 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 of a negative event, it's also the input for a positive event. Think about that, guys. A lot of people in the world whom we thought had failed at something were actually on their way to great success. Jeff Bezos failed at his job practically because he had to resign, okay, 95K a year. He came out of the job disgruntled. He failed. Most people would, you know, class that as failure because, you know, he did not stay in the job on, until 20 years after or 40 years after he felt disgruntled for some reason he left now when he left he set up Amazon now do you think that that failure at his job was beneficial I think it was I've shared the story once here about a guy that was sacked from a bank all right he was sacked he was, he, he was just a simple worker at that bank was sacked he was earning a very low income and he wept sorely He's someone that I knew personally, but then he went on to create his own bank, his own bank. Now this is back, guys, this is back in the days when I was young. And he set up his own bank and that bank has grown by leaps and bounds. So failure at his job as a bank of a worker and now owning his own bank, not just the CEO, but the owner of that bank, wealthy guy, okay? So whatever it is that you're doing today, I want to challenge you not to fear failure. Take your failure, take it in stride, look at it. You will see that in that failure lies a great success. Maybe you've been sacked from a job. It could be a signal from the universe that you should climb higher, okay? Or that you should even set up something, you know, on your own. So once you start getting that mindset that failure, as I said before, is not just an output of an event, but the input for another, then you begin to accept failure and use it to move forward. Mary Kay said, we fail forward to success, all right? May all your failures turn to success in 2020, all right? So all of you born in the month of December, Happy birthday and make sure as you eat the chicken and the rice and you know drink all the whiskeys don't overdo. You don't want to have a fat tummy like Big Man Tyrone. <laughs> Feliz Navidad my friends. Big Man Tyrone out. <laughs>